Hi, everyone. Welcome to Kiki and Kibbutz. Happy Felon Friday. It's Mary, and I'm here with this week's edition of Love After Lockup, Life After Lockup, Love During Lockup, Word on the Street. So let's hop right in. I am so excited. I am crying tears of joy. It is Felon Friday, everybody. It is hot AF here in NYC. It feels like it is 525 degrees out there. I opened up my front door to um, take a package from the Amazon guy. And I felt like I was opening the door to my oven when I preheat something. But I am crying tears of joy because I realize it is Felon Friday. So, so happy. So last week, I went live with Letitia Collier, Miss Lady Boss Accountant. We all saw her last week in her season premiere. So if you didn't check out my live recap, please do so. And Mr. Collier made an appearance on the phone. So I got to ask him a few questions as well. So please check out my recap with her. And please check out my live recap tomorrow night. 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. West Coast time with a co-host to be determined. And speaking of Letitia, we have her going to her premiere party. And as we seen last week, Jade always has her Chris cut out with her. And, you know, last week, Jade um was throwing a 30th birthday party for her sister. And her sisters were talking about that if Chris didn't have the money that he did, Jade wouldn't put it up put up with as much crap as she does. So Jade is embracing the gold digger, you know, the gold digger status that's being thrown around about her. And she is showing off her doggies. And last week we got to meet Renika and her unique style, and she is showing off her unique style on the um, premiere night at her premiere party. And we got to meet Brittany and Karak, and it's a chill day for Brittany. We have not got have gotten to meet Savannah and her man yet, but here's Savannah in the Sundays. It's Cam and Eris's one year anniversary. Congratulations to them. And they had a lovely wedding anniversary dinner. Check this out. That looks fantastic. That dessert. I'm hungry, as you guys can tell. Okay. Baby Charlie's going to be here any day now. The bags are packed, ready by the door, okay? When Ch baby Charlie is ready for her appearance, they're ready for her, okay? But I do not text Cam with the wrong number because this is what you're going to get. But I really hope these people, you know, found who they were looking for because, <laughs> you know, Cam, you're a character. That's all I have to say. Happy birthday, screaming happy birthday to my girl, Amber. And happy birthday to Monique. And you guys know I'm not a Monique fan. Refer to my Wawa baby Monique video, but happy birthday, Monique. Lindsay doing her Baywatch sun kiss babe thing on the beaches of Naples, Florida. And Blaine received some minor surgery today, but he come, you know, came out of it okay. And we have Chance hanging out with the kids on a big rock. And I love this look on Bobby. Bobby looks fantastic. We have Mike and his hair with a fancy car. And Justine. You're right. It does seem like you've been pregnant forever. 
Mocha, it says that he has a baby shower Thursday. Okay, interesting. Now, we all know that Derek is now with Angel Williams, the Tubi director. In case you didn't know by now, yes, he is with Angel Williams, the Tubi director, and Elizabeth totally co-signs this relationship, okay? Because we all know she wants to be in the next Tubi movie, which apparently is going to be about Monique, which I think is kind of creepy AF, okay? So... The next movie that Angel Williams, Derek's current girlfriend, is writing a screenplay about is about Monique, okay? So, apparently, they're holding um, auditions for it, and they're publicizing it. They, they did a reel, and Derek thought it would be a great idea to DM me the reel. See my response. Also, Derek thought it would be a great idea to put up this to his story, this poll. Would you rather have a dinner date with me or a thousand dollars in food stamps? You could see what the public chose, including myself. So Monique filmed her Where Are They Now update segment. And I'm sure her sisters were a part of it. And, you know, Calandra, Calandra is usually really laid back on social media, you know, and Calandra said some things about Derek, you know, because she sits back and like she says, she sits back being chill until she can't take it no more. And Elizabeth apparently is banned from going live on the gram for, for a bit. So she goes off in her stories and I have no idea what, what she's going off about, but Elizabeth has to go off. But, you know, it's all good because there's going to be a 2B movie about Monique. So for more about it, please check out my video. Um, It's just messy, messy, messy. And I don't like it. So please check out my video, Word on the Street. And I just think that they all just need to go away. Now, speaking of someone going away, Harry. Yesterday, Harry was sentenced for his little crime spree back in January when he was running his little um, errand run for his girlfriend at the time. Apparently, Terry needed something for, for, for her car. I don't quite remember the details, but he was trying to be a good boyfriend for Terry, as you could see by her comments at the time back in January. So, apparently... um. He got pulled over and it's, he's going to serve five years because of it. Indy is sad. He pled guilty. Please check out my, my video that I uploaded yesterday for more details. But when it comes down to it, I did an article to fill you in, to fill you in on Maurice, Harry, Nicole, Lamar, all these guys that have legal woes please check out my article on word on the street reality.com for more we have ty looking beautiful as, as always we have Haley, hendrix and dalton big happy loving family we have lizzie hanging out with the kitties tyrese and deontay in front of the michael jordan statue in chicago we have Antoine and Lacey catching up on power because Antoine heard about power while he was in prison, always wanted to watch it, and finally got to binge watch it with An with, with Lacey. Antoine got to binge watch, binge watch it, and that is cool. Now, you guys tell me, who is the better Barbie? Brittany or... Heather, because you guys know it wouldn't be an addition of Word on the Street without a little bit of Heather and Dylan. So, who who is the better Barbie, Brittany or Heather? Because Heather decided that she was going to go on her own Barbie photo shoot in the middle of Target in Chicago. 
Yeah, guys. Mm -hmm. And of course, it wouldn't be word on the street without Mandy and Maurice. And we have Jessica looking beautiful, fresh face, eyebrows on fleek. And today's the laugh of the day has been brought to you by Mandy and Maurice. They have started their own family YouTube channel. Yes. I'm sorry if I made you choke laugh or spit out your drink. But yes, Mandy and Maurice are starting their own family YouTube channel. Glorietta and I went live last week to talk about her update segment, how she is an inner dominatrix, and all the inmates she likes to talk to. If you haven't checked it out, go to my Instagram and check it out. We have Garrett looking like a whole snack as usual and Emily at the Yankees game. Now, you guys, you remember Brianna, my former co-host, the chick with the blonde hair that used to be on here with me? My friend that I love so, so much. She has started her own side hustle. She started selling these manif manifestation crystal candles on Amazon. And I bought one. And let me tell you, I have it burning in my kitchen right now. And I could smell it all the way in my bedroom. It is beautiful. It came in this beautiful box. And I'm going to drop the link in my description box. Please, gorgeous, if you guys are into candles, and I know it's kind of early to think about shopping for the holidays, but I know some people, you know, start buying little things, you know, to, to, to get people things for the holidays, so think about it, check it out, I'll drop the link, here's a picture of it. So, I just wanted to close out this edition of Word on the Street by just reminding everyone I could be mean as fuck, sweet as candy, cold as winter, I'm evil as hell, or loyal like a soldier. It all depends on you. But I love all, all of you guys, and I appreciate all your support. Thank you so much. See you next time. Please subscribe if you don't already. Hit the like button. Hit the notification bell. And please share my video with a friend or 10. Thank you so much. Bye.